Hello! A lot of you have requested a Galaxy print pattern tutorial, and I've been watching Cosmos lately, so I thought this would be the perfect time to make this pattern. The one I'm making in this video is based on Orion's Nebula, but of course you can make up any Galaxy design you like. But if you need some inspiration, try doing a Google search for galaxies or nebulas. I seriously got lost in looking at all the beautiful photos of galaxies. They're kind of mind-blowing. Okay, let's paint. You can make this design on pretty much any surface. I find it helpful to start on a solid black canvas, and I happen to have this blank sketchbook cover, which is perfect. And yes, this is the same one from the hardcover elastic band closure tutorial, which you can check out right here. I'm going to use blue, red, and white paint. And I'm using a brush for each color. For the white, a smaller brush for details, and one that I can flick stars with, which you will see later. I'm using water-soluble oil paint, but you can do this with acrylic or other mediums. Depending on your surface, you might need to mix a tad of white into the colors so they will show up. Now paint on clouds of color. Then blend some lighter shades of that color on top, basically making formations of gas and dust, and combine the colors in some areas. Then with a smaller detail brush, add white where the brightest stars will be, and brush a soft halo effect around them. Then continue to lightly brush and blend on more white to highlight some of the areas. Next is a fun part, flicking on the stars. It might get messy, so prepare for white paint to flick around. Mix some white paint with a tiny bit of water. Start out by lightly flicking the bristles. The closer your brush is to the canvas, the more control you have over where the stars will go. If you do really big flicks, you'll make huge clusters of stars. Smaller flicks will make smaller clusters. This step is really the icing on the cake, because it just makes the galaxy print come together. I ended up adding more clouds of blue and added a little more red and then flipped more stars on it. So you can definitely keep adjusting it to make it how you want. If you're painting on a surface that will be touched or used a lot, you can spray a clear varnish on it and I will include the one that I've been using in the video description below. I had a lot of fun making this design and if you want more ideas on patterns you can make on your next project, check out my DIY print patterns playlist. I have a lot in there and I'm also open to suggestions, so if there's one that you would like to see, go ahead and leave a comment below. For more tutorials, be sure to subscribe and check out my channel, Sea Lemon. If you're ready for another tutorial, try one of these here. Don't forget to follow me on my social links so we can share project pictures. You can find all the links in this video and more information in the video description below.